Hey guys, in this tutorial, we are going to create a simple um, PHP registration form, and this form will be very simple. And uh, I've also created the index.php file uh, inside the register folder and inside the docs. So let's get started. So, guys, as always, I'm going to copy this one so that I do not need to uh, type all this stuff again. So, I'm going to paste. Over here in the same, I'm going to uh, replace this hello world with the uh, registration form, and uh, I'm going to create a division division class. Sorry, class equals to container container. Div class equals to class equals zero, so that I can create a couple of columns. Uh, class equals to call md for the reason I'm uh, creating the um, column is because I because I can. Uh, Place my form at the center of the uh, center of the screen. So I'm going to use this one, uh, this this second column, and so whatever I type over here, and if I go here and close, yeah. So uh, this text in the middle. So I'm going to, for the same reason, I'm going to create a form here. So before that, I have to create a division so that I can give a class name form. Since our uh, form is going to act as a top, so I have to put a form a little bit below. So for that, I have to create this uh, class form. Form. And okay, let's create a method. Also, a th or the method console for this one with the post and div div plus class calls to input input group. I'm going to copy this one. Okay, oh, uh, let's uh, create the input type as well input type uh, calls to the text in place holder as well so we we'll give this stuff letter and name also and we also provide this letter and br tag also so that we don't have to type this all stuff again. Okay, one, two, one, two, three, four. I think four is enough. And let this one be the name. That's the name. Okay, let's give the type as email plus holder as email name equals to name is also email and this one as phone and this one is also phone so let's uh, give this one as and the address so let's just do okay it's the right address and let's create the button button B U T T O N button save type equals to submit class equals to uh, B T B T N B T N primary and uh and the yeah name equals to Okay, guys, uh, let's uh, check our form. 
Yeah, so guys, this is our form, but uh, we haven't put the class in that one was form control. Okay, I'm going to copy this one class. Yeah, so this is our form. Now it looks better. So let's clear the CSS as well. And let's save as type. style.css okay let's import let's import our class link rel equals to oh, sorry style set href calls to style.css okay we have already created a class name form and then let's do something like this margin top base uh, 150 px. I think this 150 px is, is bx is enough. Okay, so this is a form. Let's give give the head tag somewhere here. Which one? Er, regis, uh, registration form and So it looks uh, good, I guess. So since we haven't uh, connected to the database, so let's uh, first create the connection. Okay, we need to go at the top. And create.php, close PHP. So this one will be the host. Since we are using the local host, this, so the host will be the local host and user. We don't have any users, so this one will be root. And we don't have a password as well. So, so uh, let's keep the empty. So guys, uh, if you are new so make sure don't give this space so if you give this space then it will validate and it will give you the error okay so database oh we haven't created our database okay let's uh, first give our name so this one will be uh, register registry uh, let's uh, give it short let's uh, write register just the register is enough register register okay i'm going to copy I've copied this and okay let's create our database okay, let them, this name is a register create and so there is fine and then let's uh, create a table uh, name the the name of the table will be uh, just, okay let's uh, write the demo So the first one is ID. So this one should be the auto increment. So we don't have to do anything. So it will increment. So at every uh, at every uh, insertion, the ID will increment. The same was the name. Let's uh, give this voucher. Dell fifty, and the third one was I think it's. Name email. email so let's uh, let me write first all the real name phone and address okay, so this one is phone virtual phone and addr yes uh, varchar 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 so that's so it is enough so this is just for the demo course i'm not going to address that long so let this one be 50 and i'm going to save this so guys we have created our uh, database and table now and we also have created our connection 
but uh, we need to do something like this my skill I um, connect connect first parameter should be the host and the user and the pass and the database I think the the fourth parameters is also record I don't know exactly but uh, I think so because I've been uh, using the core PHP since many many years uh, okay we don't not, don't uh, need any kind of variables MySQL I I think select TV select TV this one is connection and the other one is DB I think this one is not required but still I'm writing it so I think we have done everything with so let's uh, put our value into database so guys in this video I'm not uh, going to do any kind of validation so if I get a chance then I will surely do it in another uh, another video Okay, if I get a chance in another video then I will do validation so the validation will be in the pure PHP uh, I was thinking to do the validation but I, I think the video will get too long because I have to create a I have to give them a few tags over here so that's why I'm not uh, doing any kind of validation here so I think we have done correct till now here okay, let's uh, get the value uh, the first one was name okay I'm going to copy this one okay, paste here this was okay the second one was I think the email email the third one was I think phone the phone the last one was address A D R E S S this yes so guys um all of the uh, names provided pro provided inside this one uh, inside the the square bracket should be similar to this one the name okay now let's put it to the database scroll equals to my scroll i uh you i think it's great okay that's right and this my score query takes uh, two parameter so first one is the condition and the second one is the query insert into the table name the table name was demo and the first parameter was the id in the database and the second was the uh, we we shouldn't write this one oh, okay we, we should we shouldn't uh Put, put this one uh, inside the inside the query so uh, first one uh, the second was the name and the third one was uh, in the email email phone n a d d r e okay I forgot to write comma address values now we have to provide the okay the, the first one was the id so we are just writing the id and from the second we have to put all this uh all this variable over here so the second one was the name and the position should be the similar similar to this one uh whatever the name we have given over here so it should be similar the second one was the name and guys and um, don't forget to uh don't don't forget to see the see the format okay name email 
Unanimous, single court, double court. Phone. Last but not least, so this one is the address. A D D R E. This is address. It's not into demo. Okay, so it's a reload of form. Okay, I think it's correct. Steven. Steven. Okay, Steven. Phone number. No, no, blah 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 blah. So. Try to check our database. Yeah, so if you guys can see, so here is our uh, data successfully inserting inside the database. So that's it, guys. So thanks for watching. Have a nice day.